The veterans of Iowa, including New Zealand superstar Charlotte Sullivan, the all-arounder, able to just get by the young guns from Maryland. The Hawkeyes get the victory, Alina. Iowa went back to the basics tonight, and that strategy really worked for them as they pulled off the win. Larissa Livy, really excited for her team. Had a couple of rough starts in, in the beginning of the season, but they really pulled it off strong tonight. Take a look at Iowa on the balance beam. Nicole Chow, a big score in the anchor to secure the victory. Had some trouble in the beginning, in the middle of the lineup with Brianna Fitzke. They were able to drop that score. Calm, cool, collected with this veteran Hawkeye team on balance beam. And you see there, Audrey Barber, just a freshman, 9875. Gonna have a lot of fun watching her the next four years. Beautiful, impressive gymnastics. She had really difficult opener in that first pass. Emma Johnson had the fall. They were able to drop that. This is a team that's really working through some of this mistakes and, and dealing with the pressure really well. We knew it was gonna be close, and it was after every single rotation. But it was the Hawkeyes that moved to 3-0 in the Big Ten. Really exciting stuff for the Hawkeyes. I know they had a little bit of trouble first two meets of the season, but to pull up a 196 halfway through the, the season is awesome. That's exactly where you want to be this early on. <laughs> These girls are excited. Charlotte Sullivan is your all-arounder for this duel between Maryland and Iowa. Well done to Charlotte Sullivan and the smile that supports it. That's gonna do it from the Xfinity Center tonight as Iowa moves to 3-0 in the Big Ten with this win over Maryland at Maryland. Of course, coming up, it's Big Ten men's basketball action from Columbus as Penn State takes on the Buckeyes. For Illinois All-American Alina Weinstein, I'm Dean Linke saying so long from the University of Maryland. We go to the game break with Mike Hall, Ben Bruss, and John Crispin. Take it away, Mike.